All right. Fuzz Pie Guy here. We're back with a part two of the uh, four element folded dipole pole Yogi tape measure antenna. So in my previous video, I said about the, the dimensions of all the pieces of pipe and uh, the tape, the pieces of uh, tape. So we can go ahead and start putting this together. So <clears throat> I went ahead and drilled some holes here in my pieces of pipe so I can have uh, um, the holes that I can put my screws in to help hold the uh, elements in place and I went ahead and cut up some uh, velcro that we're going to use to uh, help hold this down so what we can do is here we can just get started and what I did was I went ahead and found the center of each element and drilled a little hole in it So I can put my screw through so we can just uh, screw that in there line our hole up and uh, we'll just put it down in there do is take a piece of our velcro and uh, put it on here nice and tight and we can just turn that around like such and uh, <clears throat> that will definitely hold it in place Like I said in my previous video, I used this antenna for a uh, SSTV pass, and it was a little breezy outside, but the antenna, my other three element one, it did really good. It didn't fold up or nothing because of adding these pieces of pipe here and Velcroing it out there. So, I mean, it takes a a lot of pressure to get these to fold back so we can go ahead and put this guy on here and I'll be right back all right so I got that other one on so now I'm just going to do the uh, folded die part section here um, what I'll do what I'm going to do is put a little solder down we'll pretend this I should have done it before I do this but oh well I'm going to mainly just use this for receiving. So, <clears throat> then what we'll have to do is I think once I get everything done, I'll uh, throw a measurement 
from uh, here to out here for uh, 17 and 3 quarter. Because I don't know which way I need to go yet. But what I can go ahead and do is we'll use a couple pieces of uh, Velcro on this piece. We'll use one just to hold this side down. <clears throat> and we'll put one over here. Then once I get this measured out, then I can put another one around the whole thing and that'll help hold it a little bit better in place. I guess I could also find my center. Maybe I'll do this and just drill a hole in here and that will definitely help hold it in place where it needs to be. So let me do that, I'll be right back. All right, so I went ahead and uh, get that out of the way. Went ahead and found the center here. And went ahead and drilled a hole and everything and put that in there. So I think that'll work out pretty well. I don't think I'm going to really worry about putting any more Velcro there. Maybe not for right now at least. So I'm going to go ahead and throw some solder on this and mount my... Uh, feed line and uh, wherever my uh, piece of wire is for my hairpin here so I'll be right back all right so I went ahead and soldered everything up so all that's done and went ahead and put my other element on. So there we go. And they have my handle here laying around here somewhere. So I'm just going to use this as my handle. Just to put that on there like that. So <clears throat> other than that, I think that's about it. But uh, I'll uh, take some photos and and uh, put a link in the description to my website that will show the photos and my other video of the measurements and everything and uh, and also all right thanks for watching stay tuned for the next one